A new training centre for technicians and engineers is now in operation. Focusing on advanced manufacturing, the facility by Bosch Rexroth launched its first programme today with help from the Singapore Polytechnic. The aim is to provide global insights on emerging jobs and skills. Chloe Chu with more. 53-year-old Go Chai Lim has been in the engineering field for more than two decades. He was recently retrenched as he lacked certain software skills his employer was looking for. He's mainly trained in the hardware aspect and hopes to change that by being a part of this inaugural program. When I apply for a job, I'm, I'm 60 to 70 point of the job description I can uh, achieve. Now also the, because of the COVID-19, the, 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 the situation is much more demanding, uh, especially the employers. Employers is uh, much more demanding. They require about sometimes 90%, sometimes 95% all these things. So that's why I took up this to bridge the gaps up. I wish to achieve 90% or all the percentage uh, then I can get a job. And this hands-on training is just one part of what the centre aims to achieve. It will also roll out a specialist training certification with the Singaporean German Chamber next year and provide a test bit for companies to work together on advanced manufacturing projects. There's a lot of talk about Industry 4.0 but little traction, I would say it. Yeah. For us, the interest is to generate traction. As much as I like training, to not uh, apply it is, uh, from my perspective, is almost then you're only doing it halfway. What we add to it is actually a proof of concepts, we call it, that the student on a real problem of the industry, that he then applies the technologies, the, the solutions that we offer for advanced manufacturing himself and solve the problem of the company. Senior Minister of State Chi Hong Tat, who was at the event, says the manufacturing sector remains an important pillar of the economy, even in a post-COVID-19 world. Moving ahead, he hopes more sectors will follow suit. Whether it is uh, big companies or SMEs, there is a need to constantly look at new opportunities, business transformation, how to use technology better. And it's not just in manufacturing, it's also true in services. Uh, so I would say there isn't any sector that I think has achieved nirvana at this moment. Every sector has a uh, scope to do better. But the key for us is how do we create the ecosystem to be able to support companies that want to do so. Mr. Chi says SMEs will also benefit from this training centre because individually they may not have the resources, but large companies like Bosch can support them.